Snap! 980! There we go! Welcome back to Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening! Well, I, uh, spent some time, uh, getting some rupees, and now we're ready to get that bow and arrow case, uh, set now. Uh, 980! <laughs> Didn't take too long! Here we go! <laughs> yeah, now I'm out of money. Oh, there's bombs, and I need 10 rupees. Can I get this? I don't give credit. So oh, I gotta come back when I have enough... Mm, rubies. Mm. That's the line. <laughs> I, I do like the... Mm. It's Richard. stayed with me through all these years. Because, you know, when you're saying that, you know, trying to be coy about uh, someone, you know, uh, getting a little bit more money, it was like, uh, come back when you're a little mm, richer. Richer. But, but when Morshu said it in the CDI, <laughs> he's just, come back when you're a little mm, richer. God, he's really looking down on me. Mm, richer. Link, you're a broke ass bitch. <laughs> Well, uh, we got we, we, oh, we got a lot to do, actually. Yeah, I love well, There's, uh, one little loose end I want to tie up first. What's that? Gotta go back to Tail Cave. Oh, yeah, we that need one, to blow something up. That one, that one wall with the- Oh, hey, what are you doing here? Let's see, you got some other stuff squared away for right now. In that case, let's step into my shack. What shack? His- his shack that's up north of town means that, no. uh- No! I think we've done enough, uh, dungeons now. That the game is ready to start the hit the uh, the bonus part where we can make our own dungeons. Oh, okay, cool. I think I'll have you play those. Oh, are you gonna make me dungeons and I'm gonna play them? Yes, I'm gonna make you dungeons. No, oh, that sounds play. perfect. You got to play the dungeons and you're going to be like this is kind of fun. <laughs> Maybe. I wish this dungeon was a little mm, richer. More rupees in. <laughs> More! More! All right. Oh no, the mini Moldorm! So, get a bomb out here, put a bloop. I love how Link placed it in himself. Yeah. Like the explosion was within him all along. 50 rupees? Uh, it's oh. a secret seed shell. Oh. What do you do with it? I don't know. Why are you asking me? Maybe. Maybe you listen into it. Hold on, what's it say? Who's your daddy? <laughs> Probably one of my favorite Who's Line scenes from a hat. So are you kidding me? The the entire episode with Robin Williams was one of the best <laughs> so Who's Line good. episodes ever. Although Wayne had a pretty good uh, good start on that one. Put me down! <laughs> <laughs> God damn, I missed that show. <laughs> Pick it up. Like Mr. Carver's fall now and hold it. Oh, back to back to the kid's uh, little xylophone piano. I think my sister had one of these pianos back in the day. I wonder if it still works. If you put the bomb Come in there, like, maybe. Wait, what? Yeah, bomb arrows. Bomb arrows. That's still in the game. Perfect. Oh, that's 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 exciting. Yeah. Wait, that's a thing. That's a thing. Well, it's a little hit, little secret thing you can do. That's cool. So you just have to have both of them equipped and then shoot an arrow. Yep. Nice. Actually, we can head back to the mysterious forest. Listen to what Bow Wow was saying earlier. Remember the wisdom she taught us. Woof. Yeah, that's some wisdom. Aw. Don't hit these things. I don't like it. Yeah. Actually, doesn't that start off like a glitch showcase for Link's Awakening 2019? Does it? I think you have to hit the fox and have it follow you basically to Dungeon 2 and it knocks you past the plant monsters to get you into Dungeon 2 early. Oh, I gotta carry the thing with me? That sounds maddening. Hey, it gets you into dungeons early. Oh, well. It might also help you glitch all the way to the end of the game. Well. Speedruns, man! They're crazy! Alright, where was that one, uh, that one area she told me to dig? Was it over here? Something like that. Maybe down there. Hmm. 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 Oh yeah, there it is. I'm gonna get Will you. You fucking just hit me already. Um, yeah. Get out of here. Get. Get out of here. 
Jeez. Perfect. Y'all make the map. Hooray, we got power. Dig. D dig. Dig. Hey, another another secret, secret seashell. seashell. These things are everywhere. Hello! Yeah. Oh, stirs! Uh, are they? Oh, we yeah, they are. We got stirs! Hello, stirs! Uh, oh. Oh, I think I remember this. <laughs> did I just light a, an, un an unholy altar? That, uh, uh -oh. Yeah, you did. Hey, kid, you woke me up from a fine nap. Thanks a lot, but now I'll get my revenge. Are you ready? I'll let you carry more magic powder. <laughs> now look at all that junk you have to carry. Oh, no. You accidentally throw powder on him and he just lights on fire. <laughs> Now I can carry double the magic powder. I can set more things on fire. There so are that... skulls down there. They look like they might have carried yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. Lift those up real quick. So we can lift these skulls. So that demon uh, was actually in Link's Awakening too. He was the guy that uh, halved your magic use. The first time I saw him, it was on the it was on the Game Boy Advance because that was like the first time I got through all of Link's of uh, Link the Past. Mm -hmm. When I saw this guy, I thought I fucked up. It's like, oh no! Yeah. I can't. Well, what do I do? I, t well, I can't do anything in there right now. We'll be back. We'll no be worries. back. Be back. There is one other thing I know you can get here while you're in the neighborhood. Oh my god, you just threw a rock at that slime. Stood no chance. Do you think a rock being hit with a slime would probably feel pain? A rock being hit with a slime or a slime being hit with a rock? Either or. It Yay. Oh, nice! Bow Wow told us to dig here, too. Uh, I believe that slime would just, like, separate, but then he'd be, like, really cross about it. Like, he'd cross his slime arms and just be like, All right, you really want to do that? You really want to be that way? Get this piece of heart in here while we got the chance. Yeah, let's do it. Over there. And then you push that rock up. Get rid of those. Easy. Nothing to it! Now, is there something else in here? I don't remember. I don't think so. Like, there's nothing in the other screen? It's just the way back. Oh, okay. I couldn't remember if there was a jump spot or not. Alright, now I think it's time to explore a new area. I like new areas. I like new areas, too. They make me, they make me happy. Whenever I get to a new area, it's like, oh, wow! New place! <laughs> new stuff! New things! So, when you played this, was it basically uh, like uh, playing this... it for the first time again? Um, in your opinion? Yes. Nice. I mean, everything was still familiar, but because, the, you know, the, the flow of the game is different, you know, the quality of life features, of course, but the fact that everything's zoomed out, I can see things on, yeah. you know, from a distance, like, what's that over there? Oh, I want to see that. Want to go check that out? Yeah, Let's I want to go, go check that out. I think that's, like, the last thing I did before I found another game to distract myself with. It's the fishing hole! Yeah! Hmm. I want some fish and a little money. I only charge you ten rupees. Only okay. ten? I only have nine. Oh, I only have nine. Maybe there's <laughs> Hold on, one. Let me go cut your grass. Maybe one of the Minish has one hey, for me. Hey, there we go. Thanks, Minish. All right, all right. The Minish let me uh, let me a dollar. So let's let's go. I hope I don't have to pay them back in a new generation of consoles. Yeah. And go fishing. Oh, I see it. Yep. Hold back the control stick. Let it fly. Hopefully the fish doesn't catch it. Look the other way, please. Stay away. Yeah, look at that jerk down Stay there hiding away. in the grass. Oh, don't you do it. Don't you do it. No. Come here. Come here. Oh my god. Please. Oh! It's alright, it's alright. Oh, come on. Oh no! Oh, we'll come back. You see what we're going for. Yeah, well, yeah, th there's, like, hidden bottles. Uh, th they don't work the same way that you think they do in other Zelda games. They're good for capturing fairies, but when you die, the fairy doesn't revive you. Ew, so you have to use it manually. There is a, there is a specific certain way to, re to revive yourself when you die, and we don't have enough money for it. Okay, well, we'll get it eventually. But now it's time to go to new areas. Yeah. The Ukuku Prairie, and then the Animal Village. Oh, that's right, there is an Animal Village. Yeah. Aw. Well, now we're in there, in the Prairie of the U 
Yukes, yukikis, ukuleles. Uki uki. Okay, okay. Right, where can I push this? Uh, maybe push that rock to right. the right. I got it. Do that. Lift that. Throw that. And push, push that. Do this. Hey! 50, 50, 50 yeah, roops. 50 bucks! 50 roops. Come back in, try and get the piece of heart, because I think we're about ready to get a, another container. Hot oh, dang. I'd, 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 I'd very much like that. Gosh, hot oh, dang. I oh, know, right? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, sheesh. Oh my gosh. I mean, like, sheesh and a heck of plenty. Gosh, oh my god, a guardian acorn! Sorry, that was... There, there was a reason. No, that was... No, no that absolutely was... Absolutely not. No, it was totally warranted. Yeah, I mean, it's guardian acorn. Makes you take half damage. Wow. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. Ah, there we go. Do Yeah! It's, yeah! It's too bad you can't jump over these rocks, but then again, that would break the entire game. So I totally understand. Gotta put some limitations in check. I know, I know. It's like uh, you know, playing Cyberpunk. I just found the double jump. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh, I can now get on top of buildings. <laughs> Was that a cybernetic enhancement, or...? It was a cybernetic enhancement, yes. I'm just thinking they put in, like, Go-Go Gadget spring shoes. <laughs> like, like I went to, like, one of the, the really poorer districts, where, like, you know, there's barely any residential areas, just a bunch of people slumming around. Buildings. And I go into a, a Ripper Dock area, and it's like, Oh, yeah! You're in one of the best Ripper Docks in the game! Oh! And I'm like, like, oh, really? Okay. Cool! Warp panels! The oh, that's so nice. There are warp panels. There aren't very many of them, and they're not as helpless as you think, but there are, like, a few ways to warp around in this game. Yeah. It's kind of neat. I'm gonna head up here, actually. I spy some stairs. Ah, Zombo! Actual, like, actual Zombos? Well, it's, it's a ghoul or whatever. Oh, I mean. we're in a cemetery. People die in Legend of Zelda? Well, yeah. Why do the ghosts have to be, like, cute? Same with the trees. They, they don't die very easily. One of my favorite uh, tools this is B runs was uh, of the original uh, Legend of Zelda for the NES. Mm -hmm. And it, it involved using all these ghosts in the cemetery. Really? Basically, they did, like, some sort of memory overflow by having too many ghosts available <laughs> on screen, and then, <laughs> and then he played the flute which the game just went, no, nope. don't like that. And it took him right to Ganon's fortress. That's awesome. Actually, I think I think less than that. I think he won. That's, I think I think it just ended the game right there. That's it, it, so it did great. A, did a whole bunch of, of uh, glitchy screens, and then it's like, okay, we're done. Mm -hmm. We're done here. Glad I got bombs. Why did we go up to the cemetery, by the way? Just for fun. Oh, okay. I didn't know if there was something you wanted to get up there. Well, uh, Crazy Trace is up, is, up, is up there, but we don't have enough for it yet. Enough? She makes you pay? Well, yeah, you gotta pay to get her uh, her remedy that she that you can use. I thought you were about to say her services, and I was just like, Excuse me? Her, her potion services! Oh, okay, potion services. That makes a lot more sense. We've come a long way from walking into some lady's uh, house, and uh, <laughs> our, our, bar, our bar goes up. Yeah, and then a uh, link to the past. <laughs> You walk into town, you talk to a lady, she goes, There he is, guards! And then she narks you out. I tried to give uh, Zelda 2 a fair shake a couple of times. I tried. I really did. I still haven't tried it or the original Legend of Zelda. Oh. <laughs> the original Legend of Zelda, you know, I think it still holds up. I'd like to give it a shot. Like, no hints, just go in like I was a kid without a Nintendo Power subscription. Yeah. Just to see what would happen. This is Richard. Hi, Richard. Are you a frogman? Salutations! You wouldn't know by the look of me, but I used to live in the castle. My servants went berserk, and I was forced to flee my villa. So, you're looking for something, aren't you? I may have just what you're after. But first, I want you to retrieve the golden leaf I left behind in the castle when I fled. Okay. <laughs> okay. Smashing! To tell you the truth, there are five leaves, and I want them all. Okay, you'll need to do some digging, so buy a shovel, which I did. Are you off, then? Good luck. All right, peace. Aw, oh, look at the little froggies. Oh, I know why. Gotcha. I know why we're staying uh, here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, you take, know. Take a listen. You know, uh, just uh, skip ahead a few minutes here. Just one sec.
Exactly the same. It was very abrupt. It's like it's playing this lovely tune and then it just goes, Whoa! And then plays the song. There's Wait. a different dialogue for checking people's drawers. Like, you know, it's like, What, it's just a dresser. Oh, what, you knew that? Okay. Mm -hmm. Nope. Frog, sir, please. Sir, excuse me. All right, excuse well, me. Well, now that we've got uh, the other little uh, fun cameo out of the way. Yeah, yeah. Let's go ahead and get that shit back. We got it. I'm down for getting that shit back. So let's go. Dig for it. Hey, since we're looking for golden leaves, does this technically mean we're gold diggers now? We gotta get it first. Okay, that's true. That's true. Because I, I mean, look, if, if, I mean, uh, I'm not saying we're a gold digger, but Richard looks very affluent. <laughs> we work hard for the money. <laughs> This looks I think so this cute. Leads somewhere else. A little signs help because I think the castle is right up there, right? Yeah. Oh, 50 Cadillac bases. Castle is what he's talking about. But it's locked. Richard, hey! We're we're at at <laughs> Ooh, we're okay. Gonna, we're gonna need something special to get over that. Uh, like being able to jump in between the holes. I think I tried that before and I got very close to being able to skip everything. I think there's a way to like, uh, you know... It's very specific. You gotta like... Go down, left, up, left, down, left, up, left. Do that to like, yeah, yeah, yeah. every, like every other frame, frame. Or whatever. It's ridiculous. I'm, we're gonna need some it money. It's very bet. difficult. Yo, bananas, bananas. Ooh, ooh, give to Kiki. Yes, bananas, bananas. Ooh, ooh, Kiki monkeys come repay him, Kiki. Oh, ho, ho. did you know? that chimpanzees are some of the best carpenters in the animal kingdom. Really? Yeah, look at that bridge. That's beautiful. That's handy. Cool! Now overthrow the government! Bye! <laughs> you come back to your opening village and it's just in shambles <laughs> under the new monkey regime. And you're like, what the hell happened? And you look in the distance over an animal village and you see gigantic skyscrapers <gasps> and... <laughs> What have I done? Airplanes and drones flying around, satellites being launched. Link continuously pinches himself, is like, please, hey, please, wake up, wake, wake up, up, wake, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh, hey! the stairs. I like stairs. Stairs are good. I like stairs. They got Goombas under the stairs. God, the spike pits underneath here. Who did they think was going to invade? Me? Oh. Wait. A game hero who couldn't jump. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it! You found Rock's feather. What do we do, guys? So there are places to dig out here. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. This is why I got stuck all, like, while trying to play this. I didn't even notice the dig spots. See, we're here to learn. Oh man, I'm such a gosh dang fool. Yeah, there's another one. I may be full of shit. We'll see. <laughs> oh, come on, have some faith in yourself. God, ineffectual knights. No wonder this place got overthrown. Okay. Maybe. I know they're not they're not here. all in the castle. I don't think. What did they think that was going to do? <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah. Oh now you're in trouble. Now you're in trouble! Yeah, now yeah, you're in trouble! Yeah. Now you're in trouble! Now you're done yeah, fucked up! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright! Oh, this guy. God, with the piece of power, he doesn't stand a chance. And... Wait a minute. Oh, you're gonna do the thing? Damn, I was hoping for bomb arrows. That would've been really funny. Fitting, too. Ah. Look at that! Holy God. His Yoink. friend got caught in the crossfire. Hey, golden fleet. A golden leaf. I almost said golden feather. It's got uh, feather-like qualities, I'll admit. Really? Not there either? Huh. But I thought there'd be more around here somewhere. Right, yeah. Is there a special trigger for it, maybe? We already did that one. I mean... 
I mean, why don't we go into the castle first, see if there's anything that we can find there? But Or maybe me. blow up bird. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, I knew it. Really? I knew it. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I do five. remember things about this game still. I'm sorry, I can't be of more help. That's fine. Into just, the just, castle. Your 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 uh, sounds of awe and wonderment are all I need. Wow. Oh, yes, more. Mm, yes, yes. Oh my good golly gosh! Oh, yes, please, more of that. Holy fuck! Alright, a right, little, little much, dial it back. Oh, there it is! <laughs> okay, not too much excitement on that one, and it's just like, hey, he killed the guard, and you're so, so Richard tells me, oh, you'll need to buy a shovel. Doesn't say you'll need a bomb to distract the fucking vulture. Doesn't tell me I'll need to murder my fellow man. Well, it's okay, because these guys are clearly evil. I mean, look at their angry eyes. I play Link to the Past, I know. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, definitely. Now this guy's got a freaking throwing arm. Get go. out of here. Oops, shit. Ow. Out of here. Out of here. Out of here. Out of here. Door's open. Very nice. Huh? Huh? What is it? Huh? Door's open. I mean, what? Yeah, that, that was more of a confused hunt. Like, huh? <laughs> Ooh! Breaky breaky. Yeah, he says get uh, shovels, but it seems it's bombs we'll need more of. Breaky breaky, Link's awakey. Uh oh. Link's a breakening. A breaking yeah, That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yeah, get him up against the corner. Fuck him up. Right, hey, right, got, this right, right, got this Link. Got this Link. Out of here. Hell yeah. Goddamn shields that they got. All right, one more. How dare they defend themselves? Which is obviously at the very end of this, so... Wait, really? Should be the fifth one you get. That guy! Ah. Can you throw bombs at him? Like, you have the power bracelet, right? Yeah, but I don't think uh, the three will do it, and I think they want me to do this uh, in a specific manner of ways to do it, you see. I have a strange feeling he'll also respawn. Yeah. Ah. Gotcha. It's also the way out. Which is nice. Very nice. Oh god, yeah, this. So, another good thing. You see this door? It's got a pot on it. It does. Are there more? They won't, they won't tell you sometimes, but you gotta lift one of the pots and throw the door and open it. So Indistinguishable that... in the Game Boy game. Okay, so there are more visual hints. Yes. Good. Uh, I always hated these guys in Link to the Past. Always messed me up as a kid. Because they do so much freaking damage. There, got it. Yeah, speaking of which, care, watch your health. I'm good. It's a, it's, it's all good. As Link clutches his broken arm and sp <laughs> just sprained an ankle. Ah, oh, okay, got it. Oof. God, I hate that. Are there any hearts or rupees in here that could help me out on my- of course not. Mm, heart. It was a heart, so it's not totally fruitless. Yes. <laughs> and bombs. Oh, demolition. Excellent. Got a single heart and a single bomb. That's... positive. No, that's right. Got, got, help, help! Jumping over shrubs, jumping over shrubs! You're, you're running back to Richard. Richard! 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 I got it! I got it! I got it! Richard! 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 I was waiting for you. Richard! Help! Just jump down the hole. Richard, help! Richard! 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 I say, is that that Link gentleman bunny hopping his way back to my back to my estate? Oh, I see they finally added a jump button to the Zelda series. That's 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 outstanding. Ah, uh, series is ruined now. <laughs> Breath of the Wild will never be good. Hey, you stupid leaves. Uh, Tribune! Ah, uh, Tress Bayan. I see you've recovered all the leaves. Now move the statue and you will find your reward. Oh. Uh. I think he's supposed to be a reference to some other Game Boy game, like the one with the frogs and it's, the prince and yeah, the, he's the, the really long title. and Yeah, it's, 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 yeah, it's him.
Yeah, he has a reference. I just can't remember which one. Because we didn't, we, you know, we're Americans. We never played it. It's it's like the Frog Prince or something, and you can tell because he, you know, uh, the, 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 the Froggy Prince. Th there's a lot of frogs everywhere, and the mm -hmm. theme is different. And the to and the Toto Kenke song was in that one. We got another secret seashell. I remember you showing me a uh, a video that showed at the time all the Toto Kenke songs, mm -hmm. and one of them was in like a tank game. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, the first one? X for Game Boy? Yeah, 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 yeah. That one's pretty funny. I think my favorite, uh, Hidden Secret was, uh, the one in Wario World. I don't remember that one. When you hit pause... Oh, that's right! The don't... pause music goes, Yeah, 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 If you do it for 50 minutes... I'm sorry. He stops and goes, Sorry. <laughs> Before getting right back to it now! This feels a lot easier to do in the remake than the Game Boy version. Alright. This is called Pothole Maze. Can you... Can you... Can you... Can you guess why they're, uh... Can, can you suss it out? Could, could you... Could you perhaps denote a possible reason? As to why it's called that? Not a gosh dang clue, friend. Oh, please. Oh my god, I can't believe that worked. Sequence break! Oh, thank God, a heart, too. Okay. Uh... Hmm. Well. <laughs> you jump inside. Oh, oh, what the hell? Oh, oh what the hell? We gotta jump get, in between them. We gotta get the Pegasus boots. Jump in between them. All right, all right, I'll grant one jump in between. <laughs> no! No! Okay, well, never mind. Oh, well. So what was the point of coming here if you couldn't get the actual thing they wanted you to get? The real reason why he said to dig. Right underneath my souls? Oh. Right underneath. Oh. Nice. But it's the slime key. We can Ew. open the gate in the Cuckoo Parrot at level four. I hate it. Wait, wait, level four? Three, I mean. Oh, there we go. Fall straight into another pot. No! <laughs> I don't think there's anything else here. I think it's just a way around. Just a roundabout way to get over here. Okay. So we're good. Oh my god, it's right there. Uh-huh. It's right here. <laughs> Didn't even know that. Sloop. Hello, Shloop. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Now we gotta get over there. Aw, oh, damn it. That'll be easy, right? Wow. Yeah, it should be. Yeah. It's amazing. We've also got the next leg of the uh, trade sequence to do real quick. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Gotta find where that beehive was. Uh, yeah, there it is. There's Terran! Hi, Mario. What's up, man? Oh, please, no. I know what you're about to give him. Can I borrow it for No, don't. No, no, you fool. Go no, ahead. No, 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 you fool. I'm gonna step back and let you work your magic, buddy boy. You fool! What do you think was going to happen? And then hey, you, hey, don't come by here! I was, oh, about I, say, I was about to say, you get caught in it, too. I was like, no, 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 God! Oh, I got some honey! Cool. You're not sure how it happened? Uh, I think I know exactly how it happened. I, I was I was present for that. Terran's an idiot. I, I bared witness to him poking a beehive with a stick. And the consequences were very obvious. Come Link. over here to the left side of the porthole maze and we get some islands to jump to. Link, do you know how uh, Taryn got all of these bee stings? Oh, not a clue. No idea how it happened. Bee stings? Oh, that, that's just nuts. <laughs> Ma'am, I'm just a simple outsider. I don't know I don't know what uh, your fancy <laughs> rules of nature are. <laughs> and Taryn's like, no, 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 tell tell them. Tell them what you saw. I was like, I, I didn't I see anything. I don't know anything. where he got that stick. <laughs> do you think I know what happened? I mean, you could pick up a stick anywhere. There's a forest right next to us. Yeah, I mean, it's just absolutely nuts. Well, next time, we're going to pop into Slime Cavern. Mmm, slimy.